So a little disappointing to not get the three points. It was a bit of an arm wrestle of a match. Uh, how do you feel about the penalty? Um, I thought it was a very poor decision, very soft penalty. Um, same thing happened to us last week again. You know, I'm, I'm sick and tired of commenting about referees' performances. I think they've got a lot of work to do. Um, it's you, you can lose games. Yeah, you know, I, I don't mind coming to Bentley here. They're a good footballing team and. They score a great goal, a great move, and they score a great goal. We lose the game one 0 fair enough. But referee killed us again with that decision in uh, the game. You know, there was obviously a lot of time after that to score a goal. But um, yeah, that's football. And uh, you took uh, Mubara off at half time and brought on Dean. Uh, what was the the thinking there? Was it to try and manufacture more opportunities? Yeah, look, um, you know, the two boys are back at the, in the back line for Bentley and Webster and uh, Topalovic. Big, strong boys. Um, I was trying to go with a bit, bit of pace, you know. Both both Calvin and Dink are very quick footballers. Um, you know, I thought Dink started, I mean, sorry, Calvin started looking a bit tired probably in the last five minutes, the first half. So I thought I'd give Dink an opportunity for 45 minutes to, to run at him. Um, he did that in the second half. And, uh, again, maybe you know, a bit more luck, he could have gotten the score sheet. Today. And uh, looking at uh, how many corners that Hume City got uh, today, have you, you thought about your set plays and, and are you going to change anything? No, look, um, we, we've, we've done our set plays. We work on them you know, every week. Um, sometimes they're going to work better than what they do on, uh, on other days. But, um, no, look, it's, it's always good to get set pieces. But you're right, you know, you've got to hurt teams when you've got so much. And uh, coming up, you've got uh, uh, some tough games coming up. Yeah, you'll be happy to know that uh, Green Gully just went down 8-2 today. Uh, but uh, other, other than that, you've got Melbourne Knights and uh, South, South Melbourne coming up. Uh, what are you doing to prepare for those games? Yeah, look, it doesn't matter who we play. Um, it is South Melbourne next week, so regardless of what they've done today or this week, it's, it's up to us to go back to the training ground and uh, prepare for their game and um, you know, work on stopping their strengths and work on... Uh, Expanding our strength sort of thing for the week. So, no, look, you know, we look forward to all the challenges, be it South Melbourne's, the Gullies, the Bentleys, doesn't matter who it is. Um, you know, there's a lot of good teams out there, and uh, like I said, we look forward to playing all the more. Thanks very much, Louis. Thank you.